Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a very special episode of the Future Villains Podcast. My name is Jacob Best in the Realm Otter. Jeremy. Whoa, shit. I wasn't ready for that. <laughs> That's why I'm doing it. <laughs> was right. Jeremy, the Coach Brooks. You're sleepy over there. Just right. the best Monaghan. The hell? Wait, I don't want that. Can we start it over? No. I'm pointing to people. Oh. You need to watch. They listen, you watch. Okay. Brian, Brian, man, Peacock. Kimberly! You're going last just because now you can properly go. Should we start it over? You were like just the mom. You don't get no restarts, you, go. No, there's no restarts. There's no edits. Go. It's this is good. a shit podcast, not a proper podcast. You're uh, saying in the 90s you just can't stop and go? Yeah. What? Huh? Well, I already asked Are you, you going to introduce yourself? I don't know. I'm just the mom. You got to speak up a little bit. <laughs> yeah, don't do that. Well, I don't, don't know. Don't do Brian. I'm Jess. Good enough. Jess with the mess. <laughs> just, just the mom. Yeah, just the mess. Well, she's got as many titles as you do, Brian. You're now, he can only do everything, or he really does everything. Uh, uh, fabrics, uh, Bryman, Bamusa, all your titles from uh, the, la- the first LARP. <laughs> oh, God. First of his name for your... Go name. ahead, do it, do it. Do all your titles from the first LARP. I would have to find the list. Oh, Jesus. There is a <laughs> list. But speaking of that, um, you just made the list! No, no one's making a list. Um, and one of the upcoming LARP events, it has to be somewhere where they're, we're on a lake or something, we're going to do the death of Darius. Who's Darius? Oh, my, well, my that's a LARP okay. character. Okay. I'm going to build a little Viking longboat, and we're going to send it out into the middle of the lake with it set on fire. Are you little, sure we can do this? I don't give a shit. You could barely start the fucking grill earlier. How are you going to do this? I can set <laughs> Damn, he Viking. just put you on blast, <laughs> son. I can set a longboat on fire. This man, you can't start a grill. Hold on, I will say, no, he start started it. the grill, he couldn't keep it going. <laughs> I don't want to pour a bunch of chemicals on it. And he put too many chemicals. What the hell you did, bleach? Yeah, you pour bleach on it, right? That's how, I guess that's how we do it in the hood. That's how we do it. Bleach on grills. Is that what you got? I asked you what was in there. It's bleach. What's in lighter fluid? We were talking about this earlier. Lighter fluid. (laughs) What is it, though? (laughs) Fluid. Are we just not supposed to know? You probably don't want to know. You don't want to know everything that goes on in life. Yeah. Orphan tears. What? Orphan tears? Orphan tears. They're highly flammable. Well, thank you, Orphan tears, for making our food delicious. Yeah. Cry me a river. It's still hot. Yeah, this is the perfect time. What are we talking about? I told you we're talking about whatever we want to talk about. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's a petroleum. There's oh, a gas okay. type of gas. Okay. Oh. Now, That's now okay. We know. The first time I started a grill, I used tiki torch fluid. <laughs> it almost killed people because I cooked them food. <laughs> what was this? I was tiki probably about fluid. 10 or 11. <laughs> and I wanted to cook for these little girls at our campground. And I used... The fluid that I found, it was the tiki fluid for, like, the lights. Where were your parents? I don't know. It was at a camp. It was, like, a camp event. It was Where first... was any responsible adult? And there was probably, like, 500 adults because it was, like, an NA function where all the families got together. And, like, yeah. I don't know. I was They wanted food, and I was going to cook for them. Good uh, lord. Yeah. Cook them or cook it? <laughs> cook for them and, I guess, uh, try to poison them. I was, like, 10 or 11. Either way, somebody's going to be eating. Yeah. Somebody's going to be cooked. It's how you finger. That's what I told Brian earlier when I, I opened the lighter fluid and like flung it in my face. And I was like, well, I'm catching on fire tonight. <laughs> so you opened lighter fluid and it flung in your face. A little bit. What is wrong with you? And y'all? you still lit the flame? Yeah, it's not going to reach my face. <laughs> yes, it will. No, it won't. It never yes. did. Because there's not enough on you. Well, yeah, exactly. You put a little That's why I wasn't worried about it. And you strike that match. <laughs> Uh, and honestly, probably the little bit that was on my face probably did burn up. Like Just saying. Do I need to grill over here for now? Yeah, I was, that's what I was hoping you'd show up. Damn, man. Maybe hey, you didn't show up till <laughs> after everything was done. Sorry, you know. <laughs> he just came for the food. I came for the food. He did. I'm relaxing <laughs> the on the The burnt couch. chicken. That's what he does. He shows up with his food. Hey, <laughs> it is what it is. <laughs> and you barely ate anything. Because I had chilies before this. Should have done that. I like I knew he was having a barbecue. We probably should have told him ahead of time. <laughs> Why did no one tell him? I barely knew. <laughs> I've known for like a week. 
Yeah, you had plenty you of time for a week. to know. I've told Feel you like, like damn, way yeah, we've been talking ago. about it since like last weekend. Yeah, I just found out like an hour ago. Apparently. So, uh, Apparently, we need to start po- posting it all, all over Facebook for everybody. If there's not a Facebook event, yeah, for it, we'll make you an event next time. If it's not, <laughs> not even because this morning, I wish you were there to see this. I woke up at eleven. What time was the event at? Eleven. Okay, I woke up at like eleven twenty. And I got a message from Brian saying, are you going to make it out today? And as I was reading, I was like, what for? And I was getting out of bed as I was typing, what for? And then I saw the Facebook reminder for today. Like, <laughs> it didn't remind me yesterday. And I was like, oh shit, on my way. And I got the chairs, I got the laptop, I got the cameras, I got everything packed in like 10 minutes and left. <laughs> yeah, I'm getting more efficient at packing for the LARP days. The chairs were just by the door, so I just chucked them in my... Yeah, yeah you're lucky I took them out of my car. Yeah. You well, we didn't even use them. Yeah, it's here. Okay. Make sure. And I got two chairs as well. But there was two big benches there. Yeah. I didn't know. <clears throat> and the park is really nice. Have you been over there? Have you? Mm-mm. Beverly Hills Park? So. No. You guys should go over there. there. I have. Remember when they were doing the movie in the park over there? Oh, yeah. And they were showing uh, the, movie? the new Jurassic Park movie? Oh, yeah. Okay, I have been there. That's a super nice park, and I was going to give him all kinds of shit if it wasn't a nice park, and it was just close to his house. <laughs> yeah, it's like two minutes from here. Like, I did the directions because I was thinking it's either by your house or maybe further into Beverly Hills. Right. And, like, I started the direction, and I was like, that motherfucker's house is right there. <laughs> right there. <laughs> like, minutes from the park. But that is one reason I chose it, because if we need something, it's probably here. Yeah, there's also a community center we might be able to rent. Yeah, and I think it's pretty cheap. Probably, from what I could tell. Usually they are. Very cheap. Probably like less than 100 bucks. Yeah, I think it was like less than 50. Oh, yeah, maybe. So, go ahead. We rented the one in Beverly Hills, and I think it was like $50 for my sister's baby shower. The community center one. Yeah. In the park? Was it right over here? It was on like a circle. Oh, that's where uh, CGA show did their show. Yeah. Oh, show, okay. Show, show, well, show. But there's different rooms you can rent yeah. different prices. I think we also did a birthday party there with my family. Yeah, but if we could rent like a big hall and do like a legit feast one That'd day. That'd be so nice. Even that place where they did the CGA show yeah. isn't far. No, it, it's all right in here. So we could pretty much be like, all right, everybody, head out. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that'll be pretty. Charge good. like five dollars a head to make up for. Uh, what did they charge at the other feast? Oh. Uh, it's ten dollars for a day, but that fed you three times. Okay. Oh wow! If you're there early enough, I'll probably make that work. But don't you get reimbursed? Well, is that something we can talk about on the podcast? Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I think um I don't you know. You exactly find out how about it works. that. Yeah, but it's like I know our park doesn't have funds yet. No one's paid any dues yet. Oh, we're supposed to pay dues? Yeah. How much? It's super cheap. Okay. It's six dollars and you're covered for six months. Oh, okay. So it's a dollar a month, really. Probably should tell people about that. <laughs> and dues are only if you want to vote. Okay. Definitely so, want to vote. I'm political. <laughs> yeah. So if you want to be involved in the voting, you, you have to pay six dollars for six months. But. Can we vote people out? Uh, I think so. <laughs> okay. We have to look into it. Not like out of the park, no. Ah, damn it! Out of office, <laughs> I think. But I don't know. Right, I can vote you out of office then. Right, we need to get people in office first. Oh, okay. we need to get enough people to fill the offices first. How many offices do we need? Am I in office? Four Why or five. are you looking at me? If you want to be. Oh. You want to be in office? I want an office. Why did you look at me when you said that? <laughs> Why did you look at Jess? I don't it would, understand. It would be nice if we had help. With what? Have you asked her yet? Mark. Hold on. You, Go ahead. You want me... There she goes. A full-time... How long is it going to be? I have a full-time job, I am a full-time student, and I am a full-time mom. When do I have time to govern a LARP event? I work full-time, I and I'm a full-time podcaster on the weekends. Okay. That's a <laughs> little different than being kidding. a full-time student. I'm, a, I'm, a I'm full, full-time. I work overtime, usually. I work. Don't give me that look. I don't see nothing for that. Oh, it's there. Trust me. No, because I get salary now. 
<laughs> well, that sucks. <laughs> and then... I'm a full-time asshole. So, <laughs> yes, I agree. <laughs> but I love you anyway. <clears throat> so... We're... I don't know. What? Do they really know what? I was wondering if they knew that he and I are together. They figured it out now. Oh, well. <laughs> we're so in love. So, yes, yeah, so you have plenty of time to govern. No. Now, granted, you probably shouldn't be prime minister. Because <laughs> no. that's a very involved job. You know what? Forget it. <laughs> what? What the fuck going on in there? Nothing. The ghost. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Do you guys want to tell that story? I want to tell that story. <laughs> no, go ahead and tell right, the story. <laughs> All right, so me and... Hold on. we got to tell a quick story while we're off LARP. Okay. I okay. nearly died today. <laughs> Again. Dude, I need to stop going to LARP events. Yeah. I don't really... think I ever told the other story on the podcast. I don't think so, because it happened so long ago. Yeah, so my first big practice, right? Yeah. What was that, Dag? Yes, and that was in what's now Smoldering Springs. So we go out to this practice, and uh, probably the first time I've really fought a lot, at least fought that intense, because those guys fight intensely. That they do. Um, I was running around. I've got a bad ankle. I'm a fat guy. I can't be running around like that, I've learned. Uh, I didn't feel well, so I went and sat down. I think Brian asked me, hey, would you bring me one of those waters? I did. And I sat down, and next thing I know was, uh, what were we called at that time? Uh, we were Shadow Spar. It's like, hey, Shadow Spar, is that one of your guys? And I woke up to what would become one of our, you know, unit members, John Verrado, like, in my Korsgar. face, trying to wake me up. Yeah, sorry, Korsgar. J- trying to wake me up, and then they, everybody making me drink water because I had passed out. Yep. Not fun. First time I've ever blacked out in my life. Yep. Well, I experience it every day. Yeah. You were there for that, weren't you? No, I remember that one. That oh, was just... when we went down to Spring Hill? I don't remember him passing out. No, that was just you and Lance. I went to the Spring Hill one. Yeah, we didn't go to many. But no, I, don't we remember, didn't. I don't remember Jacob passing out, though. Oh, uh, I don't know. Because ju- it was just me, you, and Lance. Oh, okay. yeah. I don't even think Charles or anybody else was there. And then today... I'm standing there filming? Or was I just watching? I was just, okay, so I was just standing there, and I heard a thud, and oh, Brian yeah. starts freaking the fuck out. <laughs> yeah, I was, I was, uh, shocked. Because there was a team across the little road of cricket players, and the cricket mm. balls are very heavy, right? I don't know, do you know? Somewhat, yeah. Are they like a lacrosse ball? It's like a lacrosse ball. Alright, yeah. So he almost lost his life today. Like, they were far away. So this thing would have had a lot of momentum. And it went over the pagoda. Yeah. So yeah, Brian was like, that ball just hit where you were just standing. (laughs) Yeah. He was just kind of moseying around. And if he didn't mosey one step towards us, that cricket ball hit right where he was landing and just took off. And you would have got money for it. (laughs) No. (laughs) I doubt it. Yeah. I don't think these guys had money. Either way, you suing somebody. I would have had a big old dent in my head. I'm okay with that. You'll be fine. Oh, speaking of suing, though, we were yeah. watching uh, a new Sonic cartoon, and Dr. Robotnik, or Dr. Eggman, <laughs> was <laughs> suing Sonic the Hedgehog. That was a weird-ass show. Sonic T. Hedgehog, which had me rolling. I thought that was funny. Yeah, they're in a courtroom, and Knuckles was Sonic's lawyer. It was really funny. It was bizarre. Yeah, I didn't know what the hell was going on. That's not my drink. No, that's mine. Here, take your drink before I okay. drink it. Oh shit, I still have stuff in here. Yeah, I know that. Drink okay. It. <laughs> Go ahead and tell your ghost story. God damn it, I thought we were past. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I have a baby monitor. It's um, it's a camera that I can see anywhere I go, and I can actually talk through it. So, one night, I had left it up in the living room, and Jeremy, the coach Brooks, was laying down on the couch because he slept over, and then I went to work, and me and Kimberly, we worked together, and so we were sitting at the desk just looking at, and we decided to peek into the, to my phone to see what was going on, it's and we see, <laughs> we see Jeremy still sleeping, so I just say into the, into the camera, I said, 
Woo! And Jeremy like pops up, looks around, and goes back to sleep. And then I went like a couple minutes later. I said, "Boo!" And he kind of looked around again and went back to sleep. A couple minutes later, I just yell, "Wake up!" And he, I've never seen someone's eyes get so big. He, he shot up and looked around. And then I said, I'm in the camera. And he still did not know that it was me. He was freaking out. There was one day I was out here. Shut up. <laughs> I, wish, I wish I had recorded it because it was it was so much funnier than it sounded. Oh, my gosh. It was great. Well, I hope you had a joy of scaring the crap out of me. Oh, it was awesome. I would do it again. Uh, you probably would. And we no, will. you have such big reactions. You do it to yourself. Oh, you shit. Funny. I'm asleep. <laughs> I can't help that. It's you sleeping, and also you start hearing noises, you're going to have reactions too. You lost your shit today when something fell off the wall. Because <laughs> it just fell it, off the damn wall. It was the ghost. It was the ghost. And he's convinced our house is haunted now. This shit is haunted. <laughs> because of the thing that Jess did. <laughs> oh, yeah. Jess a ghost. Didn't you, think, ghost. <laughs> didn't you think it was haunted before that happened, though? No. You didn't? Probably not. I thought you said something, which is what made me do the ghost thing. Well, that picture on the wall that changed when I walked past oh. it for Halloween. Oh, maybe. Those are creepy. But other... What are you doing? <laughs> is she trying to take a She's selfie? She's taking selfies. Oh, I'm, I'm, no, just my, just my pajamas. I thought you yeah. was trying to get oh, a signal or something over there. Dead pajamas. pajamas. Yeah. Those are cool. Because who goes to their friend's house wearing pajamas? Me. That's I usually thing. show up here in gym shorts, so... That's your everyday attire. It is. It's comfortable. Yeah, this is probably the first time you see me dressed up. I didn't know you were dressed up. I asked. I was gonna ask <laughs> you if that's what you wore today, cause that does not match. What are you talking about? <laughs> are you in agreement over here, Kimberly? What's it? Light gray. Why does it not match? Dark gray with brown shoes. What's wrong with it? I wear this to work while I teach. it's like a fishing shirt or something. I don't know what the fuck it is. Yeah, it's a fishing shirt. Okay, to each their own. Maybe you went fishing. At church? No. I was fishing at a funeral. Fishing for what? Oh. <laughs> what the hell were you fishing for? I can't tell you that information. I go to jail. <laughs> <laughs> now, this is what I wear when I teach. What we call it's it. a nice outfit. What's wrong with it? I'm sorry. Okay. Just because I ain't from up north don't mean nothing, Jess. I, fishing shirts has, are class wait, it in has the nothing, south. It has nothing to do with being from up north. Y'all about that Macy's crap. I'm Bass Pro Shirt. I don't even like Macy's. You know who Macy's is? Do I know what Macy's you know, is? You know who Macy's is. Why do you know who Macy's is? I know what Macy's is. Do you know that's a real person? What? What? I'm done. I'm me too. <laughs> I'm mad at you. You're always mad at me. Just finally cooked and it tastes good. Are you happy? Yeah. <laughs> we, we Wait, I've been that. cooking for like three weeks, four weeks, almost four weeks. No. Yeah, but weeks. I don't think he's eating any of it yet. Oh, well, that's on, him. that's on him for not coming over here when I'm cooking. Like you announced it. Hey, I'm cooking. Come over. I don't sound like that. No, we literally did. Is it earlier? Hey, we're cooking. Come over. Yeah, my <laughs> phone died around like an hour ago. Whose fault is that? Like I knew y'all, want y'all to tell me earlier. Listen, you, you need to come over for Thanksgiving because I make bomb Thanksgiving dinner. Yeah, we it's should have amazing. a Friendsgiving. We d I thought we did one year. We yeah, did one we year. did. Oh, okay. I invite Burberry. you guys. Oh, guess year. what? We're gonna have a low carb friends Thanksgiving Woo! this year. Low carb. Yep. That's what our uh, barbecue was. We're doing low carb. I'm bringing a deer. Okay, no deer's low carb. Low carb. Huh? Please. Deer's do. low carb. Deer jerky is amazing. Oh my god, my dad makes it. It's awesome. Yep, and then you steal it. Apparently. I steal all of it. He's, he does not want to make it. I have deer in my freezer right it. now. I have venison. You do? I still have venison up there. What? Yeah, we ate the cube steaks and I still have some something else up there. Like Where did you get venison? I don't even know old, get it. old co-workers, they hunt and A she deer? made it. Yeah, I mean, like, where you can't buy it, right? Yeah, butcher shops probably have it. It ain't real if you buy it. Listen, I had moose one time. It was Sorry. good. Ew. In American Chop Suey, it was so good. What you? Why you? I want to eat a moose. I Why? eat anything that walks. Yeah. What? They took you because they got the big old antlers. Listen, a moose almost killed my brother when yeah, they're they were not me, so. They're gigantic. Only yeah. Bullwinkle. Have you ever seen one? A like moose? My grandfather are... drove oh. under a moose one yeah. time by them accident. Things, them things get real big. <laughs> what do you mean? 
fucking under. He drove no. under it. It died, but he oh, did, like the top of the car only hit the top of or the bottom of his belly. What was he in? He was in a car, like a regular a car. Do, you've never seen a moose in person, have that you? That is the definition of a tall tale. No, I, I mean I'm no, telling I, you the truth. I believe it because we drove the the first moose I ever saw. We drove past one. We were in an S10, and. It was it's laying. Gigantic. It was laying on the side of the road, just like chilling out, and it was as big as the damn truck, laying down. That's why up north, like in the Alaska area, moose is the only meat that's perfectly eat. They're so huge, they can last you a whole season. Yeah, you know, I would pretty much stuff. eat whatever except cats. <laughs> I that cat. would just make me sad. I had cat. Dog, I guys, guys, my cat is listening. Stop. Good, I'm eating that little no. golden black you, stuff. I mean, at least once per podcast, Brooks threatens to cook it because it's running around with them stupid bellies My cat? Or you guys talk about my cat on the podcast? That you cat puts to. itself in a situation to die. I think that cat is part of the podcast. She's sleeping. She's minding her own business, being super cute. Listen, I love that. Leave it alone. Don't oh. mess. Oh, you're just taking everything out. Did you just get that on my carpet? No. Oh, I'll clean it up. Hey, oh my god. <laughs> leave what, it what? alone. No, nah, you spilled soda. You woke the damn cat up. I did. But anyway, my voice is crap. Listen, this moose <laughs> thing. <laughs> my brother and my grandfather. It was when he was a baby. But they went under the moose because my grandfather fell asleep. I'm telling you, stop laughing, Kimberly. He went. Obviously, the moose Listen, died. I know you're it doesn't... Gra- Is it your grandfather from Tennessee? No, okay. my pa- my other grandfather from on my dad's you side. You go under a moose, went through a moose. Well, he went under. <laughs> no, the whole like... car went under the moose. But obviously, the legs are too narrow, so it broke all the moose's legs and it fell on top of the car. And now they have the antlers hung up at my dad's house. <laughs> And my brother had not a scratch on him. It was amazing. Y'all need to go on a road trip. Yeah, I want to go on. We go. We hit a <laughs> we went on a, We're going to go on a road trip. We road almost trip. hit mattresses. Oh, oh my, my God. God. That was crazy. This guy. Uh, okay, we were on our way to Tennessee. Me I and almost Kimberly. hit a Bigfoot. I'm telling you a story. This. Rude. this is amazing. What you okay. call me? Shut up. Hey, <laughs> I'm the goddamn coach, bro. Don't tell me shut up. I'm sorry. Stop yelling at I'm me. I'm sorry. Okay, so we, me and Kimberly really were on our way to Tennessee, <laughs> and uh, we it was nighttime, and we got behind this truck that had, man. like, this, I don't know, like... He had a trailer with, like, 12 mattresses or something. Yeah, but it was, like, plywood and duct tape. Like, yeah, that, it was, that was yeah. the trailer. <laughs> so then all of a sudden, all of it, and he didn't even have tail lights on. Like, he didn't have lights on. No, he didn't have lights, nah. And uh, so his mattresses started... Coming off of the trailer on the highway. Well, you know, the car is going 80 miles per hour. Yeah, so I had to slow down to, to get behind one of the mattresses because it was going across to the median. Oh, my God, it was so scary. And he turned his headlights off when he started dropping all the mattresses. Yeah, he didn't even stop. We had the, we called the police, though. Cause yeah, because there's mattresses all, all over, over the, the freeway. <laughs> you can't just attack me. Yeah, because you're messing with her and she's on her perch. Leave her alone. I had to make the noise as part of the podcast. No, it's not. So you got to mess with my cat. She was all fine just laying there sleeping. Now she's going to kill you. Your cat doesn't like me. My cat doesn't like anyone but me and Riley and Brian. She just meowed at you. She did. Luna. She hates me. She's going to get you. She likes to play with me. I don't think she's playing. (laughs) She's she's planning your death. I think her hair is standing up. Look. She's mad as hell right now. She's going to kill you. For real. Look. Jiggle, that damn cat going to jump on your ass. I'm going to laugh. <laughs> it's going to be recorded on the podcast. Her tail's twitching and everything. She's pissed. Stop, Jacob. <laughs> Listen, when she scratches the shit out of you, I don't want to hear it. High five. Psych. I wish we had this on video. <laughs> Ow! Don't we do. Her. We do. We do. I'm videoing oh, this. Jesus, really? <laughs> look, look, Brooks, we finally get video. <laughs> It's live, kind of. <laughs> yeah, both, of, both of you are using your front camera, god damn it. I wasn't drunk. I was not. Oh, oh yeah, I was. Backwards. <laughs> I was thinking this was the front. And you're filling in portrait mode. That's the only way to it do it, It was a right? video. This is on photo now. You said you can't take video in portrait mode. It looks terrible. Your face looks terrible. She's staring oh. at you. you know, Listen, oh. she's staring at you. You took video in portrait she's gonna mode. She's going to kill you. Don't be mean to her. She likes Kimberly I take sometimes. video in video mode. Sometimes, yeah. She's she sat on me for like a second and then left. 
It was a start. I think she got confused. She sat with you at the foot of uh, your feet. There it is. There's the noise. Now the podcast is complete. Yay. One of these those are going to be cut off. No. Do they, th- that's how I know where she is. Because you can hear it? Yeah. <laughs> that's how I know where she is. I don't like that. Because if she goes out the door, like I'll hear her coming. So I don't want her to go out the door. You mean you'll hear her going? No, I'll, if I open the door and I hear her oh, trying okay. to get out, I can stop her. Can you stop with the video? Oh, my God, my hair looks terrible. Kimberly. Panorama. Panorama, rama, bama. You got to stop it at some point. Panda lamp. Panda lamp. Oh, my, my, I'm a damn, a damn. Did you do it? Yeah, but you're, you know, you're like, oh. <laughs> I got to send it to you. We look her no, up. Riley has my phone. Oh, yeah. Um, and he's like, what's up? <laughs> this is Jess. <laughs> <laughs> Do you guys want to talk about your low-carb life? Go ahead, Kim. Uh, speaking of low-carb, is there a... Uh... Never mind. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> is there a plate of burnt chicken in the kitchen? Yes, there is. <laughs> my specialty. <laughs> it's grilled, not burnt. I don't know why I keep saying burnt. How good was my chicken? It's Jeremy? black. I don't know if I'm joking, but girl, don't be telling people your chicken be black. You don't want to eat it. <laughs> what did you, you got, say about chicken shouldn't be darker than... Your chicken should never be darker than the darkest man in your house. <laughs> and at the time, Jeremy was not at the house. Look, I knew Jeremy was coming. <laughs> but ain't black history month no more. You ain't got to make black shit, all right? But uh, just made... Some chicken that had bacon wrapped around it. And I love me some piggy, pig, pig. Oink, 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 baby. It was also stuffed with cheese and broccoli, so. I'm talking about bacon, though. Okay. Did you make one with the spinach stuff? I did. It I was did. so good. And, and to point out, ladies and gentlemen, I've been coming to a Brian house for a while. And I've been begging Jess to cook. This girl won't cook. I've been begging her to cook forever. You know, and she, finds, she on this low carb diet stuff. Which is good, which is awesome. I've lost 15 pounds in two weeks. Her and Kim do it, and I'm proud of them because they, they, they want to live longer. And she made this chicken tonight, and Bon Jovi, this stuff was good. I had to give her a compliment. What the hell y'all doing? Sign language? What? <laughs> this is not say, good for a podcast. She she lost 15. She doesn't think I lost 15 pounds, but I was three pounds down today. I lost 10 yesterday when I went to the bathroom. You waited? Yes. Oh, you didn't tell me this. Yeah, I know. You got pictures of it? No, I forgot. I'll show you. Pixar didn't happen. Yeah, exactly. That's what I'm saying. Pixar didn't happen. Fine, whatever. I don't care. I know, so I know that. The bummer knows, too. Who knows? But my sister was poor. Y'all hear what I said? Obama no. knows? Is Who said anything said? about him? That's what that's I what said. I, that's what I, what I, no, said. I said I lost 10 pounds when I went to the bathroom yesterday. Yeah? And the bummer knows. Did you have a baby? Oh. Damn there. <laughs> Obama's your plumber. That's okay. <laughs> Obama's my plumber. Is that what plumber. he's doing now? Yeah, he's got to do something, you know? I don't want... Ugh, okay. All right, I had enough political Yeah, we're that. done. <laughs> no more. Dang it, Brian. You trying to piss me off. That's what I thought I heard. I but would never piss, say that. Don't piss him off until the Heels podcast, because I'm going to piss him off. All right. I want I want to take a nap, but from Jess and Kim sitting here, I'm afraid of my life. Should be. They should be, yeah. <laughs> I was trying to take a nap all day. Yeah, I might wake up on the roof of some shit. Don't know how I got it. I wake up in jail. Uh, no, hold on. Explain. There's a black no, hold on. on my Explain. Couch. We just got no. home. How how would they get you on the roof? If I'm asleep, I don't wake up unless like I hear voices. Sleeping pills. Benadryl's better, yeah. Benadryl. What do you think was in that chicken? That's why I take three Benadryls and I go to sleep. <laughs> oh, we would find a way. What? <laughs> why didn't Cassidy was so insistent on you eating it? She didn't throw that shit in my face. Mm-hmm. Yep. If Wait. that girl you put something in that damn chicken. <laughs> she did? that girl Rufies. put anything in that goddamn... <laughs> Actually, that's what I feel like doing. Yeah. Me, that's all the tryptophan. That's what's in the chicken. The who wants to the turkey. Tryptophan. Put your foot. No, it's in there's, chicken, there's too. There's more in turkey. Yeah, obviously there's more in turkey, but it's in chicken. You have to too. eat like four chickens. Guys, I was I wasn't oh my god. <laughs> no, you no it's serious. Oh my god. I wasn't being serious. No, no, you're serious. This is a very serious Am I? podcast. It very serious. Very Stop serious. fucking around. Oh Guys, I'm gonna get on topic. 
What the hell's the topic? Everything. Hot topic. <laughs> All right. <it's laughs> on topic, off topic, on screen, off screen. What? Hot topic. No, between the panels. What are we between doing? Between the lions. <laughs> between the who? It's Bananas a, it's and a pajamas. PBS show. Oh. Are we doing like word association now? Sure. Car. Tire. <laughs> Tired. <laughs> moose. <laughs> Goose. <laughs> Cars and moose apparently go together. They do because my future. Did God make the excursion? They don't go together. They go on top of each other, according to Jess. No, <laughs> the moose goes on the car. <laughs> I'm just saying. This is a real story. It really happened. Yeah, it really did. Big no, story didn't happen. You are 100 percent correct. It is a real there story. There are pictures. I will get my dad to send them to me. There are pictures of how big the moose was next to the car, and his antlers are at my dad's house. I'm telling you, this really happened. Okay. I've seen moose. I tonight, didn't. Brian, tonight, Brian agrees. Magic in your eyes. That's not something that normally happens. Thanks. <laughs> I'll just say it. Best fiance ever. Well, what you mean to say is fiance that's always right all the time, ever. Oh so. my god, here we go. <laughs> you need a reality check. I substitute your reality <laughs> with my own. So, who was it that said that? What? Uh, Are you looking at a picture of a moose and how big it is? You believe yeah. me now? Adam Savage. Yeah. From Mythbusters. What, what are you finding, Kim? She's looking at moose and how big they are. What are like, like the world's large? largest moose? This was the type of It says of they're moose. like four to seven feet tall. Okay, and how tall is a car? It was not a big car. You're not a big car. Did you say truck? What? Did you no. say it was a truck? No, no he, was someone was talking about an S10. This one was. Oh, this one? Brian. Leave your cat alone. I was I'm, looking at her. <laughs> we just got dead air. I admire her all the time. She's a beautiful cat. Do you guys have anything I'm else? Any stories you want to share? I'm, I am just full of stories. Good ones. Yeah, stories. No, real life situations. The largest Alaska moose was shot in western Yukon in September 1897. What? So it was 7.6 feet tall at the shoulder. That is a basketball playing moose. <laughs> right? They're really tall. They're really big. That's what she said. All right, so this has been the Future of Villains podcast. Thank you for listening, guys. We're just going to end it there. Why? Oh, that's what she said. Well, yeah, we're we have another podcast to record. <laughs> and these two are tired. So thank you for listening. Uh, you can find me on Twitter at Best of the Realm, Facebook Best of the Realm Gaming, Twitch.tv slash Best of the Realm, on YouTube Best of the Realm. You can find me on Twitter. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> um, you can find me on Twitter at Brian25 or Instagram Brian1138. You can find me at your mother's house. <laughs> oh, damn. But if not there, you can find me on Twitter at JeremyBrooks42. I just spit it on myself. <laughs> Or Instagram, jbrooks42. Fuck you, Joe Rogan, and fuck you, coach. No. Okay, that's out of context. John, stop with the fucking Joe Rogan thing. Okay, you can that's, find me yeah. on Instagram at just say no to carbs. There's no underscores, no nothing, just one complete word. Really? You fixed it? I fixed your mom. You that's can't. no. <laughs> <laughs> no one's going to be able to do that. Do not, you oh, have sorry, a public Instagram or anything? You can't find me anywhere because I'm a very private person. It's true. <laughs> Your Instagram and everything's oh. private? I'm not giving my information to anybody. Yes, I have a Twitter. What is Wait, it? Um, yeah, it's out. all wrestling. It's so. like OB, yeah, it's all wrestling. But That's it's okay. OBJess112, I think. I don't know. Something Maybe. like yeah. that. You don't want to follow me anyway. <laughs> follow <laughs> her to see her try to win... Fan of the night. And I always shows. try to win fan of the night okay, every time, over. and I never do. And then you know what makes me mad? I'm not even gonna say it. I'll say it after the podcast. Oh, I know. What it makes, makes me mad. so angry. And we just missed the NXT show in Ocala. I want to be able to tell those stories night. one day. Mm-hmm. Those stories. Yeah, those uh, stories. Those are good uh, stories, but we can't. We will one but day. Someday. Yeah, I saw Alistair Black was wrestling. We could use and, code uh, names. Ohio, and he wasn't going to be in Ocala, and I was like, yep, oh, fuck it. <laughs> you didn't need to go? Nope. <laughs> I was going to go, but it was a Thursday night. 
Oh, Brooks wants me to shut the fuck up. All right, thanks anyone. for listening. You can find all of this content on YouTube under Future Villains, Twitter at Future Villains, <laughs> Facebook is Future Villains Entertainment, and of course you can find everything. And we're gonna be joining. We're, Drudge and Drudge talk. Approved. we're gonna have more LARP stuff coming up. We've got the, the Lion Door video coming out really soon. Uh, yeah. You can go find out why you shouldn't fuck with Korsgard right now on our YouTube. And you can find all of this content, including there's going to be brand new content coming very soon from new creators on futurevillains.com. That's F-E-W-T-R-U-E-V-I-L-L-A-I-N-S.com. That's the first time I fucked that up. Thank you for listening, guys. We gone. We gone.